Hey, this is Nate. Just wanted to do a quick review of your website and give you some pointers. You know, scrolling down through here, this looks like the basic free Google template, you know, free Google site. I probably looked at 10 websites today that look just exactly like this, other than the content's been changed out and it's got different pictures. You know, I do like the fact that on your before and after pictures, you are putting your logo in there as a watermark, you know, it helps out with branding. But you really need to get some content on this page. Personally, I would rebuild on WordPress, but even with this, you can get things up and moving. We recommend about 1,000 to 1,500 words on this homepage and about 500 to 750 words on your back service pages. With Google, content is king. You want to get those keywords and keyword phrases that people are typing into Google organically into the content on your page. It's not the only way to be found for a particular keyword, but it is the easiest and fastest way for Google to recognize those keywords and know that your site is relevant to what people are looking for. So I put you into one of the SEO tools. Your title tag and your H1 tag are two of the most important things Google is going to look at right away. You've also got your meta tag description here. You don't currently have one set up. So when somebody does find you on Google, there will be a description there, and it's just going to be random content off of your website that Google picked so that there was something there. But your title tag right now, right side power washing dash pressure washing services. I would switch this around. I would do Palm Bay FL pressure washing dash right side power washing. That tells Google where you're at and what you do, and it has your company name in there for branding. Because your company name is Power Washing, by using Pressure Washing first, you're now picking up on both of those keywords. So you've got the area that you're in, Pressure Washing and Power Washing, all three in your title tag. Your H1 tag right now is Bright Side Power Washing. Generally, that is this right here on your website. I would do, you know, you want to build that clear communication with Google. Tell them where you are and what you do. Change out your H1 tag, Palm Bay FL pressure washing, and then right below that, when it's no longer part of the H1 tag, put done by Brightside Power Washing. So you've still got your company name in there, but make that H1 tag super short and sweet. Build that clear communication with Google by seeing that that information with your title tag and your H1 tag kind of all match up. Google crawls the site, sees your content, sees you have those keywords and things in your content. Google wants to know that your site is relevant to what people are looking for. If I search on Google, Google wants me to find the answer. So next time I need something, I go back to Google and I look there again. So they want to make sure to, to provide relevant information. <coughs> Excuse me. Some examples here. Palm Bay, Florida pressure washing. This right here, this blue line is your title tag for all of these different websites that are ranking on the first page here. This right below that is the meta description. These words that are bolded here are not bolded when you make your meta description, but Google bolds them when I search telling me that, you know, your site is relevant to what I'm looking for. It's got these highlighted words, which are words that I typed in. But if you look, you know, a lot of these sites, and it's not every single time, but a lot of these sites are going to say, you know, pressure washers, Palm Bay, pressure washing, Palm Bay, pressure washing, Palm Bay. You know, if nine out of 10 of the top sites have pressure washing and Palm Bay in their title tag, that kind of shows you the importance of making sure to get your service and your area into that title tag. So I hope all that helps you out. If you've got any questions, you know how to find me. I will talk to you later, and thank you for your time.